Welcome to this short clip on the cost accounting ledger feature in SAP Business One version 9.3. There are some settings that need to be made for the cost accounting ledger to become active. A separate numbering series needs to be maintained for cost center adjustment postings. This series is marked as cost accounting adjustments only. There is now a new cost center transfer transaction. In the account definition, a flag for cost accounting adjustment only restricts the GL accounts for use in the new cost center transfer transaction. The new cost center transfer transaction can be called up directly from the distribution report. Defaults can be set up to automatically populate the cost accounting adjustment transaction, including journal vouchers. Our business scenario is as follows. OEC Systems distributes its electricity bill based on the number of employees in each department. This month, however, some support consultants were pulled into the development team to help in some documentation. Management would like to ensure that the costs are correctly reflected in the different cost centers by making a month-end cost accounting adjustment posting. Let us have a quick look at this in SAP Business One. Earlier this month, an electricity bill was received and input by the accounting clerk using a service type invoice. Let us have a look at that invoice. The invoice was posted to the electricity account for £100 and distributed using the D1 employee department's distribution rule. Let's have a look at that distribution rule. This distribution rule is divided between the sales development and support departments or cost centres based on the number of employees in each department. 60 in sales, 10 in development, and 30 in support. You have been told that this month some support consultants were called to the development team to help out. Let us run the distribution report. As you can see, this invoice has been divided into the three different cost centers, sales, development, and support. For this month, however, this division needs to be altered such that both development and support have the same cost for electricity. We highlight the distribution rule code and click on the cost counting adjustment button. This launches the journal entry for cost accounting adjustment. The posting that we make here is to reflect the correct allocation of cost to the relevant cost centers. So we need to ensure that an additional 10 pounds is allocated to the development team. And the same amount is removed from the support team. The posting is made to the GL account 910100, which is defined as a cost accounting adjustment only account. We add this through. Let us run the distribution report again. If we just collapse this distribution report, we see now that the development cost center has 20 pounds and the support cost center has 20 pounds. The cost adjustment has been made. If the cost center adjustments need to be reviewed before committing them, then you have the option to set up journal vouchers to reflect the adjustment posting. The option to set this up is under financials, journal vouchers, and under add journal entry to new voucher, you have the option 
to add cost accounting adjustment entry to new voucher. This opens a voucher entry for cost accounting adjustments screen. The voucher functionality thereafter is the same as that for a normal voucher. This completes our demonstration on the cost accounting ledger feature in SAP Business One version 9.3.